Hello everyone, welcome to studygun.com. In this video, we will be learning how to install Chrome OS in VirtualBox on Windows. This is a step by step guide to installing a Chrome OS 2024 on VirtualBox. Watch this video till the end and learn how to install Chrome OS in a VirtualBox on Windows. But without further delay, let's get started. Since we're installing Chrome OS in a virtual box, you must have enabled hardware virtualization on your PC. So let's go to the task manager. And you can see here performance. Here virtualization enabled. Now by default, this feature is enabled and allows you to run and test any operating system in a virtual environment. If it's not enabled, you need to check the BIOS setting and turn on hardware virtualization. Once it is enabled, you can verify the status using the Windows Task Manager. It's time to start Chrome OS in a virtual box on Windows. So now let's download the virtual box. Let's go to the browser here and search virtual box. It is the official website from the Oracle. Let's click on it. Now you can see this kind of interface. Let's go to the downloads here. Here you can see the all host are there Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Solaris. So I have Windows. Let's go to it. You can see it's asking for the location. Let's save it here and go to the downloads. Here you can see the download is completed. Now click to open it. Preparing. This is the setup wizard. Click to the next. It is the custom setup. Select the way you want features to be installed. Let it be default. And here is the location where all files virtual books are stored. Let's click to the next. Proceed with the installation now. Yes. Proceed with the installation. Yes. Click install to begin the installation. Please wait while here. Now install the virtual box. Let's go to the Chrome OS file. Let's copy the link in the description box and paste it here on Google. And here is, it is the drive link. You can download it here. Just download it and download anyway. Now asking for the location cloud ready home. Let's save it here and in the downloads. It is around 2.4 GB. I have already downloaded it, so I'm going to cancel it. Now go to the file. Here it is a file. Right click. And now open with the VirtualBox Manager. Here you can see the appliance settings. It is the name, guest OS name, CPU2, RAM is 4 GB now let it be all default and click to the finish here you can see import appliance and now let's go to the settings here you can see basic advanced and description let it be default let's go to system here you can see the 4gb ram uncheck the floppy and let it be all default here you can see the processor two processor here acceleration let it be default and go to the display let's drag it to the maximum and enable 3d acceleration for the better graphics go to the storage here you can see already our file is there audio network here's the bridge adapter here serial port usb go to the usb 2.0 let it be all default and click to the OK. Now start the VM. Let's click to the next. Anonymous data collection. Let's continue it. Here it is asking for the login. Let's log in here. Here you can see the all set. Let's get started. Get started here. Now click the Chrome. Here you can see the Chrome browser. Now you can tap here and tap the shutdown. 
yeah this is all for the video thanks for watching